Range Rover TD V8 2009. Let's charge the battery. So to pull the bonnet in the UK, open the passenger door. And just under here, you have a bonnet pull, pull it. Then this will come up slightly and underneath you will have a latch that looks like this. It's just about in the middle. Just pull it up like that and then lift the bonnet and you can open it fully like so. There is a service position as well where you can push it, the bonnet up higher, move, moving this lever here and then you latch this lever and it will open up higher. So anyway, get yourself a battery charger. You can see mine's a bit low here, 11.9 11 volt. Now we want 13.8 really, or thereabouts. So we'll leave this now for about, we'll leave it overnight probably, but leave it for five or six hours. It's automatic cut off anyway. And then you wanna get the red connector to the plus and the negative to the minus or the negative. Leave that and hopefully all will be well. Now these, these Fox budget chargers actually, if you can select repair, and somehow it does something to the battery to make it, you know, fix, but I'm not sure what that is. Here's the fuses there, if you're curious what that is. So otherwise, I'm quite new to this car, so that looks like steering fluid, radiator fluid, washer bottle, windscreen washer. I've got another bottle here. Yeah, let me know what that one does. That looks, looks to me like where the air filter goes in there. I think your EGR valves are under there. Valves. So anyway, I don't really know, I'm not a mechanic, but anyway, just showing you where how to uh, put the, uh, get the battery on charge. Bye for now.